foodies and we're back again with another video tutorial before you do anything i need you to go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button right now you do not want to miss what is coming out of neoville and so today guys we're doing something and i've did these before on the channel uh but i did mackerel croquettes uh but today we are going to be doing salmon croquette burgers yes salmon croquette burgers and so for our ingredients as you see i do have two cans of salmon but i actually i'm going to be using three cans so remember that i'll, I'll also post that in the comments and so we have our bread crumbs our eggs i have four different color peppers and because i had used those and something else i was going to use some of that in the salmon as well we have some black garlic we have our obey seasoning italian bread crumbs and our onions and so let's go ahead and get started and so what i did i went ahead and cut up my onions and i used a fourth because i had a half of each color pepper so i half the half which made it a fourth of four peppers green yellow red and orange and um so we got those cut up into little pieces and then we're going to get that in a pan real quick and saute them and i like to saute my peppers and onions inside of my before i put them in the croquette only because it makes me feel like it's done because sometimes you you know you could cook a croquette and it doesn't take long to cook a salmon croquette once you get everything together uh, because one it's out of a can and really you're just warming it up <clears throat> excuse me so i kind of like to feel like that my ingredients my ingredients are cooked all the way through when it comes to my peppers and onions and so now i'm adding now you can use regular garlic but i wanted to try out a tablespoon of the black garlic in this and i'm so glad i did it was so good um and so we're just sauteing this up and as you see it is getting a dark color which is going to make our salmon croquettes a little bit darker when we pat it out but that's okay because it's still gonna be fire and so we added a little bit of um olive oil and you can just do butter if you want to honey it's your kitchen do what you want and so now at this time we have opened up our three cans of salmon and what i'm doing i'm removing the skin from the salmon because like i said the garlic is already black and if we leave the skin on it's just gonna make them darker they're not gonna be that golden brown um normally because one i added black garlic and i did leave some of the skin on but i took most of it off i also took out those little bones that be in the salmon um i wish i would have showed you but that's okay i took out some of those little bones but when you crush it and mix it those bones are disintegrate you're not gonna feel it or be biting into chunks okay and so now i'm adding my seasonings i added some obey then i'm adding some um saison complete seasoning and we're gonna add two eggs because this is going to help bind it up when you make it into a patty. Um, we're also going to add in our sauteed veggies with our black garlic. That was yellow, orange, red, and green pepper. And then our onions. And then we're going to be adding about a half a cup of mayo. Um, had to get another jar because that one was gone. Um, and then we're going to add, and this was like, I would say a cup and one fourth of breadcrumbs that I added because I added first one cup and then it was so little in the container. I just added the rest in the container as well. And so we are getting that mixed all together and bind it really well. And once you guys, like I said, and if there's you still feeling bones in it, 
you're once you crush it up the bones are going to crush there that's how fragile those bones are in that but i did take out the vertebrae um, because they were a little thicker and so we're just patting these out like hamburgers and how big or thick you want them honey again it's your kitchen do what you want that's up to you now we did put now i'm frying these in olive oil now i know a lot of people fry theirs in like vegetable oil uh vegetable oil sorry canola oil all those type of oils but um for me <clears throat> excuse me i think the olive oil um is a little more healthy well i know it's more healthy but and i don't have to add a lot like i don't want no greasy salmon patties okay um and so we're frying these up and i fried them actually on like a medium heat because I didn't want to fry them too fast because like I said already they're kind of dark already um and so even though you could be frying them they can not be completely done and still be dark so I fried them on a medium heat and got them turned over and getting them turned over as we speak um I would have to say these were some of the best uh salmon croquette burgers that I have made and this is the complete finish and as you see there's not a lot of oil in the pan that they're sitting in guys it does not take a lot when you use olive oil and now we're just taking some buns some sesame buns because like I said these are burgers and they actually look like burgers if you look at them um, and we just put butter in the pan and then we're just adding our bread to get those toasted up. And my boys have never um, had um, salmon croquette burgers. And so I did not know how they were going to like it. And so I said, you know what, we're just going to let them taste it um, on camera. And my boys, y'all, they are so silly. Like, you can tell if they lying or not. They'll, they'll try to put on for the camera. But they really, they really like these. Like, after camera, they even want it more. So, I'll show you. That's me just dressing them up. They wanted cheese. I don't want cheese on mine. And, you know, you can put lettuce, tomato, pickles. You can do this just like a burger, guys. But my, my boys are really simple. They just like mayo and mustard. So, that's basically what we did for their uh, burgers. We just put mayo on one, mustard on another and put their burgers on and we put these together also i am on um tiktok for those that didn't know hit me up on tiktok follow me got a lot of recipes that is not on here now i'm giving it over to my sons okay so here's your salmon croquette burger and your salmon croquette burger make sure y'all get in the camera enjoyed this video guys as you can see it is a hit a winner um i'm gonna make me one of course i'm gonna put lettuce and tomato and all of that on mine so thank you all for tuning in mm -hmm. you, you okay he won't thank speak. you for all tuning in and have a blessed day It's your kitchen, do whatever you want.